Boy, oh boy, have I got a video for y'all today. How that, Garia? My name is Fastidious. Welcome to my channel and welcome to a Watcher of Realms video. We've got a short one, but a really fun one, so let's hop on in. And I must say, I'm using the word fun potentially really liberally, depending on how you define it. Anyway, without further ado, you've probably been playing the game like I have, I hope enjoying it, and wondering as you level up your champions, rank up your champions, wow, I'm making so much fodder, this is a lot of XP, you're probably wondering, how much XP is this actually costing me? How much XP am I using to make a six-star champion? So, I was wondering that, I decided I'm gonna find out. I tasked myself with that, I've taken on the assignment, Let's get right into it. And, and very quickly, I want to mention, I'm assuming you're using all one-star champions as your fodder champions, as your food. Of course, I'm sure you will use some two-star champions. You might have those spirits that you can use as rank up materials. Uh, but for this exercise, we're gonna do the worst case scenario. You're just using one-star champions. So you might be looking here, we have 10 level costs. So increments of 10, why am I doing that? Well, uh, let's say you have two one-star champions. You're gonna use one of those one-star champions to bring the other one-star champion to two stars. Well, you're gonna have to bring it from level one to level 10, and that's gonna cost you 1800 XP, as you see there, uh, and then you have a two-star champion. However, that two-star champion you're left with is at level 10, not at level one. So we don't need to know the cost here to get from level one to level 20. We need to, need to know the cost to get from 10 to 20. So pretty simply, we just need to subtract. So we know it's 1800 to go from one to 10, and I found all these by just checking max leveling from one to whatever the max of that star level champion base level I was looking at. So. 1800 to go from 1 to 10, then 1 to 20 is 750, so we just subtract that, and then 10 to 20 is 50 to 50. So to go 20 to 30, we have to um, find one to level 1 to 30, so 42050, uh, subtract 50 to 50, then we're left with 35,000, repeat the exercise, and finally 85,000 to go from level 30 to 40. All right, I hope we're all on the same page. Let's keep it moving. So now we know the costs, as we still have it here, we, uh, to make it easy for us. So you know the costs to go up in these 10 uh, level increments. But now how many champions is it going to take? So uh, if we go back here, it requires, for one six-star champion, that is going to require five five-star fodder champions, right? So the number we need, we need to figure out how many five-star champions, uh, how much how many champions go into making a five-star champion? How much XP goes into getting all those champions ranked up to create that one five-star fodder champion? So one five-star champion is gonna be five four-star champions. You'll notice a pattern here. The star quality, that's the amount you need of the lower star quality. I'll quickly just explain the first one and the same logic applies to all of it. So if you have a five-star, you need a five-star fodder champion, you need one of those champions up to level 40 of a four-star champion and then four other four-star champions that are gonna be probably level 30, um, unless you're using spirits, but in this case, they're level 30 and you use those four to level up the max four to get your five star fodder right so it took five in total so the same process here to get a four star you need four one at the max and then three underneath to level it up for the three you need three for one for a two star you need two right so then we just extrapolate so for one five star we need five four stars well how many uh two, three stars do we need to make five four stars well we do some math um, quite simply, five times four, we need 23 stars. Okay, repeat the process. Sorry guys, this is gonna get tedious. Imagine how I felt the past hour. So to get 23 stars, how many two stars do we need? 20 times three, 60. Repeat the process, we need 121 star food champions to make enough fodder to make one five star food champion. We can skip ahead here, guys. You can do some math. That means we need 600 one star champions by this process to make five five-star fodder champions, right? But let's get into XP. So we're gonna work from right to left here uh, just because it corresponds with the column. So if we look at column H here, um, so what do I mean 60 out of 120? Well, in this case, half of those champions we're talking about of the 120 need to go to the level. The other half don't need to be leveled, right? So there's no XP involved. What do I mean by that? Well, we have two one-star champions. They don't both need to go to level 10. Only one goes to level 10, and then the other one star will be used to bring it up to two stars. So of those 160, we know it's half. Half is the multiplier. So it's 60 out of 120. We know from here, it's 1800 XP to go from level one to level 10. So just quick little math, 60 times 1800, we're talking 1, uh, 108,000 XP. So already a big number. So we know that's a hard number that we need to lock in. Now to get those 60 uh, two-star champions we made uh, to get uh, 23 star champions, we need to take one third. So if you see here, we need a 
three, uh, two stars to make a three star. So one of those is gonna go up to 20 and the other two stars will be used to rank it up. So we're only putting XP into one out of every three. So 20 out of 60. Uh, so we know it's 520, uh, 5250, 5250 XP to get from level 10 to 20. We do some maths, 20 times 5250. We're getting 100, 105,000 XP. We can repeat the same process here. It's by a quarter for the four stars and here it's by a fifth for the five stars. Finally, we're left with these big, big numbers. We can go to our grand finale page and we can figure out the total XP per five star fodder champion is going to be the summation Actually, I have it right above, nice and easy. The summation of these three numbers, which of course I've gone ahead and done, that's 473,000 XP. That's just the XP, we're not talking about gold or anything else. 473,000 XP just to make one five-star fodder champion. But of course, if we look over here, one six-star hero requires five five-star fodder heroes. So, what's the total XP per five five-stars? Well, it's gonna be five times 473,000 XP, of course. So it's 2.365 million XP. So that's how much we need, right? No, because whatever champion you're using, you got at level one and you have to get it to level 50, max level at five stars, to then bring it up to six stars. And keep in mind here, you might be wondering, oh, what if it's not a base five star champion? Then I have to worry about all the fodder to bring that champion up uh, each rank and eventually get to level 50. Well, that's your problem. Uh, I can't do a dependent situation for each, or I could, but this is draining already. <laughs> Um, so what's the cost to bring any hero from level one to level 50? That's gonna be 270,300 XP. So the grand total, baby, we add those two together and to make one six star champion, we need 2.6335 million XP. So 2,633,500 XP. But as a cherry on top, that champion's still six stars, but at level 50, how much to make it level 60? Well, to bring a champion from level 50 to 60 is 355,000 XP. So we add that to this guy right here, the 2.6335 million, and we are left with basically 3 million XP. So it's 2,988,500 XP. That's your number, folks. Of course, it will probably be a little bit lower. You're not gonna use all one stars, but holy guacamole. Fast Didius.